to you, Taliana the Brava. Mahalo and welcome all precious Brava babies to this perfectly attuned transmutation mental health scape day four in the tub. Cuties, anyone who says not to make your work about your work is a man who has God envy. Yes, cuties, they envy the gods who create lives. So yes, if you're a stand-up, please get on stage in a tiara. I love the internet. Can we just take a pause and thank my boyfriends? I want to go over to Little Kamal in 2020. I'm still speaking and say, yes, honey, got an Instagram account. Zuck Muskie, my boyfriend, has provided. Okay, cuties, she is still speaking. And if I don't say it all, I'll say it again in 15 minutes. And no one's listening, but who needs them? We're working through our fields for a fortnight in the tub with me. The more time she spends in the jungle, the more wet she experiences herself to be and wild, wet and wild. So she's been thinking and writing and imagining and cutting people out and circling people back in. <sighs> she has some thoughts to share. So as I am returning to La La Land, she has been Remembering and my last night, my very last night in my LA apartment, Silver Lake, after 10 gorgeous fucking years, I wanted to throw a goodbye party, okay, cuties? But she was on a carnivore diet, so of course I gave myself some sort of bug from eating meat too raw. It was coming out both ends, I had to cancel the party, but it was perfect because that's my attachment style. But my attachment style is both ends, just spewing. My daddy he used to call me screaming pukey because I had colic as a child. So fat. So okay, Katie, so I was incapacitated in the bathroom to the bathroom. And the only one boy, one boy showed up who never reads his emails. Okay, cuties, I won't name names, so you know who you are. And we were in the back garden and he came out and we just chatted. I was like super dehydrated and cute. I probably looked like very fragile. And he was like, Why are you leaving? And it was Lucia speaking. She had just done a boga. She's like, I'm sick of being so isolated, trying to pursue this dream. I want to start a family. And he looked at me and he said, get a dog. So then it clicked why everyone in LA has their tits out and has a dog. Everyone owns a dog. The truth of it is, in La La Land, having a dog is like having four children. People cannot believe your commitment. I remember just standing around aghast when a new friend had when a friend had gotten a dog, it was four nearly 30 year old women just shocked that this woman had committed to being a dog mom. But the older I get, the more I realize that youth is a liar. The sooner you give up on your future, the happier you can become in the present moment, my jars. I was chatting with my friend Erica, who was chatting about her friend, who was chatting with her friend, who was chatting with her friend, who was chatting with his friend, who happens to be. I know I'm a name dropper from Jonah Hill, so. And she said that this, this friend told her that this friend told this friend that told this friend that they were sitting with this friend who was friends with Jonah Hill. And they were, they were like, look, you've got a great career. What are you complaining about? And this friend who, who knew Jonah Hill, don't be intimidated, was like, you're not friends with Jonah Hill. So this is the fruit, my darlings. The closer we get to our dreams, the more miserable we inevitably become. But none of my girlfriends would ever guess who I'm talking about when I speak about my successful friends because they are not successful as Jonah Hill. Okay, cuties, you're not friends with Jonah Hill, so you're a little bit happier. You're a little bit happier for not being friends with Jonah Hill and you get to go surfing with boys anytime you want. Jonah is continuously texting me, who are you sipping with now? And I'm like, boo, two cans. So my daughter is deeply alone in the bathtub. My new career idol, because we almost have one at all times. My new career idol, I know I'm yours, but mine is my dad. This man has lived a life like a rolling stone, wanting to be a travel photographer and becoming one and never settling down, never settling for nobody or nothing. And nothing was good enough for this raging, wild, acid tripping, hippie, commie man. Okay, he is, and now he's fucking 70 and he sits on a bench with a dog and he's happy. So my new goal, I'm gonna speed to that. If that's where we're all headed, Darth, I'm speeding to that. My new career goal is bench, okay, cuties? With a dog. Find me a dog, find me a bench, is good. See, Miley's been complaining. I used to be young, girl. Bless your fucking heart that you're not anymore. Filming the Botox 
grease my face, and then age my soul to 80, okay, cuties? Age me to 80, but not on the outside. Youth is a lie. When you're young, you haven't seen much, so you look in the mirror and you think you're special, okay, cuties? But there's a million just like you, and once you realize that, you can let your inner soul turn into a beautiful gem that ain't nobody yet seen. A little butterfly that's gonna fly out of your chest when you die, okay, cuties? That's the Egyptians believe. Spend more time crystallizing your soul. Here's the thing, darlings. All of the actors are going to be replaced with avatars like today. They've already been replaced by AI. So just quit your dreams. Just quit your dreams and live. <sighs> if only she could. She's deeply ambitious, as you know. If you can tell by the abdominals burging out. In a week, you'll see them. Yes, I've been imagining my comeback and I want to wear the latex bodysuit again. So she's been working hard. I am torn because I want to embrace my wisdom. Okay, cuties, I want to embrace my wisdom years of mid 30s. But I also, cuties, I want to look 16. So, women, we struggle. We can't have it all. I don't want that to leave me for a cuter girl. All my tech boyfriends are so excited to live in their avatars. I am not. Okay, cuties. So, the tea of it is today. Embrace your wisdom years while you're still young. And fuck you, because she's a liar. I want to party with you, Miley. Come to Topanga. I'll be in a cabin. And yes, if you've lost the thread, welcome to TV land, okay, cuties? Where my lyricism leaves a delightful track for you, my sweet, sweet brava babies. She's still speaking, still spewing, only for you and all of the internet to enjoy it forever and ever because it's magic. I'm like a bird, I wanna fly away. I don't know where my soul is. I don't know where my heart is. And baby, all I need for you, I'm like a bird, I wanna fly away. That was for any of you who are concerned that you look like you lost your mind.